Hello everybody and thanks for watching this quick video and update on Boeing stock. So it's Giacomo speaking and as usual we will try to uh, forecast the price movement of uh, this stock in front of us that it is Boeing or BA as per, uh, new, as per US uh, stock marketplace. So uh, with blue line it's already, already drawn the uh, major trend and uh, this is what I am Understand. This is my interpretation of uh, uh, these uh, price movements, and uh, uh, to be honest with you guys, prices has been moving sideways since uh, since uh, let's say April. So th there is no uh, a trend. So this is the m main reason why I, I, I don't use. I prefer not to use uh, exponential moving average because prices are moving. Uh, sideways and when price is moving sideways uh, I would like to use more uh, uh, other tools like uh, stochastic uh, RSI or uh, uh, MACD and so uh, because prices are moving uh, sideways and it seems that it can be mo they can be moving between 115 US dollar and 208 US dollar 208 so if we are exactly the middle of this uh, 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 this channel uh, so the idea is just to hold uh, hold because we don't know if the price can really keep going down up to this target price or perhaps uh, or perhaps they, they might jump up again uh, starting from next week so uh, due to this situation where the price is, is inside that's in the middle uh, depth of the channel the best option is to hold so just hold stand aside from Boeing right now and wait that the prices are gonna say are gonna are gonna be uh, closer to the bottom of the top lines flat trend lines uh, to go short and long. Generally, when the prices are close to the bottom uh, line, flat trend line, the idea is to go up and vice versa. When those prices are closer to the top uh, flat trend line, that can be 208 or 235, and if those two, one of those two levels is not going to be broken, the idea is that the prices will bounce back down or will dive, we bounce and dive down again. So uh, the idea is we are right now again in conclusion, prices moving sideways uh, no really there's no a trend so the idea is just to hold and uh, really watch carefully what's going to happen around this uh, level of 165 US dollar because it seems that uh, this level has been broken so because it's been broken it can be seen as a weakness signal that gives uh, uh, possibility to do those prices to go down up to 115 but again it's too risky now to go short uh, just because uh, uh, the support has been broken while the stochastic uh, seems seems to be ready to go up because it's in over in over uh, sold so based on those information that we have uh, I would hold right now and without any technical analysis uh, this is how those prices look like so and as we can see just moving sideways in a trendless condition this is the exponent this is the exponential moving average just not does not tell us anything actually it tells us that the prices are moving uh, horizontally or in a trendless condition so uh, that's all from my side uh, thanks